It's springtime in high schools in Calgary and thoughts are starting to turn toward final exams, graduation and summer jobs. But for 17-year-old twins Sarah and Tegan Quinn, their thoughts are starting to turn toward a career in music. This is where it all began two and a half years ago, writing songs and learning how to play guitar. And it might have stayed here if the twins hadn't entered Garage Wars, an annual fight to the finish between rockers and punk bands. We're like two little 17-year-old kids sitting up there and saying what we want to say and we don't have anything, nothing to hide behind. And maybe that's what the difference is, is that, I mean, the music industry, getting up on stage, going in front of people you don't know, saying things that you wrote down to yourself, that's very, very, very intimidating. They earn higher marks than any band in the seven years of Garage Wars. It's something they find a little overwhelming, but very exciting. And you know the thing that I like the best is, is that I don't think that they think, wow, they're perfect, they have no improvement, let's get them, let's get them going. I think they just see maybe a sparkle of something that can get to be something bigger. One person who saw that sparkle was contest judge and Fast Forward Magazine music editor Mike Bell, a discerning critic, to say the least. I'm not really known for liking things, um, but I, I, I see nothing but potential. I, they're absolutely wonderful. Everybody, the entire room went quiet. Um, everybody stood there, kind of mouth open, just, oh my God, because these two girls on stage with the most wonderful voices. For now, music has to compete with exams, volunteering, and preparing for the high school drama festival. But the girls have been able to do one thing a lot of musicians aren't able to do, quit their day jobs. Robin's Donuts. It just got crazy. It's, crazy, not that, crazy. it's not that we don't need the money or suddenly we are whisking away to, you know, some foreign country to play gigs and stuff. <laughs> it was just that, it's just that we're busy and we have like, you know, I'm supposed to come back after the last three weeks of all this stuff happening and like, you know, prepare for my Bio 30 diploma. It's like, <laughs> whatever, right? Sarah and Tegan perform this Saturday afternoon at the Ship and Anchor. The show starts at 4. For The Scene, I'm Brent Kotchuk.